Hi everyone, it's Matt, and this is my morning monologue afternoon version. It takes a village to raise a child. I didn't always believe that because I used to think that when they said raise a child, they meant R-A-Z-E, a child, meaning to knock down and destroy. But they don't. They mean R-A-I-S-E, a child, to uplift and to help grow up okay. It's a homophone. It sounds, it sounds the same, but means differently. Classic Matt. Oh man, I'm all about parts of speech. And when I say that I'm all about something, I'm being hyperbolic. And I share that with you because um, I'm all about being upfront with people. For example, um, I was behind someone the other day in Starbucks and then I stepped in front of them. They reacted by saying, hey, butter, to which I innocently replied, yeah, I'm smooth and creamy, to which they replied, homonym for butter, butter. <laughs> Well, upon realizing my mistake, I apologized for the misunderstanding and we had a hearty laugh. And then I paid for his, uh, for his chai latte and I told him to just leave the tip. Then I went to the, to, to the pharmacy to pick up my colon cleanse, but I didn't have enough money to buy the colon cleanse because I bought him the chai latte. <laughs> so I had to get the semi-colon cleanse. I saved money, I feel great, and I've got more clarity with my run-on sentences. I'm also all about punctuation. My favorite punctuation is dot, 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 the ellipse! It brings such dramatic tension. I want to kiss your ellipse. I also dig the colon. My reasons for digging the colon are as follows. Colon. Lists. Scatological innuendo. Rye stand-up material. But just because I dig the colon and I want to kiss your ellipse doesn't mean I don't think the exclamation point doesn't rock! Commas are, comma, in my estimation, comma, without a doubt, comma, helpful, comma, overused, one word, no hyphen, and oftentimes, comma, like me, comma, misunderstood, period. <laughs>